Hello everyone. This is a follow-up to my video on how I use Notion for my own like weekly setup. And this is the article. Um, you can give it a read. There'll be a link in the description. Uh, what I want to touch on in this video though is this whole setting up the next week process. Um, I end up saying it takes about two minutes and so I kind of just want to actually demonstrate um, how I go about to do it. So this is my notion. I'm on the years right now. Um, I'm going to make a new week. This is a template button and inside it is just a template for uh, my, my weekly template. So if we end up clicking this, it will generate it. And we're in our new, uh, new week here. So we're just gonna fill everything out, change the week title, um, I'm going to link to the previous week, so I'm just using a link to page, and that will be week 23. I don't have a next week yet. Um, then I go through the days. Uh, I know the shortcuts uh, for the renaming, so that's Command Shift R. That just lets me kind of quickly go through here, and. I just end up doing this for the days. Um, there's probably a better way to kind of go through this, uh, but this ends up working out for me. So two more here. And there we go. So all the days are, days are renamed. I go into the lights table. I also change this to be the appropriate week. And then for the wins, I have a little reminder here to set it to the current week. So I go and I just change that to Sunday, change this to Saturday, and, or I'm doing the future week and I'm, yeah, so actually that should be that Saturday. There we go. And then I just delete this because we don't need that anymore. And at this point, I go into my first day, which is Sunday, and I need to link this to the previous weeks. So what I'm gonna do again here is just link the page and I'm just gonna search for June 8th. And then I'm gonna go into that. So I'm on my previous week now, and I need to also link that back. So we'll link this, and that's gonna be June 9th. And then finally, I'm gonna go into the previous week and then add a link to week 24. And that is it. Um, everything's all linked up. Um, takes, yeah, I'd say approximately two minutes. Uh, that's for me. I know exactly where I'm going. I know the shortcuts um, to kind of do the renamings quickly. Um, obviously, it, you know, might not be that quick for you initially, but with time, you will get there. Um, I think there are ways to kind of improve this process or even automate some parts of it, but um, it's two minutes a week. It's not a huge time investment from my perspective, so for that, it works for now. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoy this video, and yeah, see you later.